Hey, what's up, guys? We back with another episode again. We back where we left off. And I kind of don't know where to go. I probably should have looked up where to go, but... No, we came from there, so it has to be there. <laughs> Stupid machine! Access encrypted fu- No, I don't want to review protocol. I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with- STUPID MACHINE! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, research assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? Uh, how do you know I'm Lisbon? Your access card identifies you as Elizabeth Bainham. Is there something you require, Dr. Bainham? What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of subject species 37. The Thorian. Tell me everything you told the Krogan. I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zeus Hope have been enacted for several cycles. What does Zeus Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zeus Hope outpost. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Are you saying Exogeny knew its people were getting infected? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. That explains their strange behavior. We should warn Joker. Joker! Come in, Joker. Damn it! That field's blocking us. We must find a way around the field. We must get back to Zoo's Hope. B.I., what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. We need to find that ship. Let's get moving. Going to standby mode. They always doing something evil, huh? I don't know if I should be fighting to stop it then. These guys are may have a weakness we have yet to detect. This structure seems to have significance for the game. Is it possible they set up this room to serve as a sacred temple of sorts? Hey, if they're looking for this was a research facility. Place of this structure seems to have significance for the game. Okay. They set up this room to serve as a sacred temple of sorts. Hey, if they're looking for God, I'd be happy to speed them on the way. Thought maybe I'd have to go to that orb, I guess not. Oh.
waiting for it, bro. Guessed it. Oh wait, did I come in from there? Or... No, I didn't come in from there. I came. From... I did come in from there. I'm tripping. Just like the other one, you don't have the teeth to tear this out. Keep looking. Even one claw and that ship will fall. No, 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 no. Next time, guys, we gotta sneak in sneakily, guys. No, just running in blasting. What's wrong with y'all. the way. Doors will be open now. We can go deal with that Thorian thing. Damn. I'd like to have seen the face on their pilot when that thing toppled. I repeat, Normandy to shore party. Are you reading? Anyone there? Normandy to shore party. Come on, Commander. Talk to me. Is that you, Joker? What's going on over there? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They're freaking out. They can't do any real damage. We're on our way back. Just hold your position. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, we'll just wait right here for you, Commander. This place will be crawling with Geth in a minute. Keep together and we'll get out of here in one piece. Maybe there would be. Nope.
probably gonna run into some more geth along the way. I like how that Krogan was so dumb that he turned around to see what happened to the other Krogan <laughs> when I sent him far away. Oh, that was coming here up here for that stupid data for that one guy. I don't really think I should have did that, but hey. It's done, it's done. I wasn't planning on doing it for him. It's cool. There you are. We should get out of here. I don't think this place is safe. I need some answers. You knew more about the Thorian than you let on. I... I was afraid. I wanted to stop the tests, but they threatened me. Told me I'd be next. When the Geth attacked, I stayed behind to send a message to Colonial Affairs. I tried to tell them where to find the Thorian, but the power cut before I could send the message. I, I... I never meant for this to happen. You did what you could. I'll help them, if you can tell me where to find the Thorian. The Thorian is underneath Zoo's Hope, but the entrance is blocked. The colonists covered it with the freighter just before the Geth attacked. But why are the Geth after the Thorian? What could Saren want with it? Well, it does have unique mind control capabilities. That's what Exogeny was interested in. Normandy to shore party, come in. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comm chatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. I'm coming with you. I might be able to help. Undo the mess I helped create. I don't remember where it was. It showed it on the map too. Well, not in the map, but in the cutscene. Oops. Oh, wow. Hold up. Definitely not there. Oh wait, there it is. Did I just go back to where I already was? This is so confusing. Hold up. I think it was through here. Okay, yeah, because now I went down that way instead. Hey. You know what? It just opened the way out. I, I should have just thought of that. That was dumb. Of me. So, where am I supposed to go now?
<laughs> I cannot drive this stupid thing. Oh my god, there we go. This is Juliana Bainham of Pharaoh's Colony. Please help us. I gotta get out, come on, let's go help her. You can't do this, John. <laughs> Everyone shut up! Uh, let me think. What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Lisbeth! Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! <sighs> Shepard, damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. <laughs> I found some interesting Hello, facts about huh? you in the Exogeny database. I know what happened on a coups. This doesn't have to end like that. We can talk this out. Nobody needs to get hurt. You, you don't understand, it's not that easy. Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, Jong. You can't just repurpose us. It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. You're after the one unique thing Pharos has. The Thorian. The what? It's a telepathic life form living under Zeus' hope. It's taking control of the colonists there. Exogeny knew all along. You won't get away with this, Jong. So you keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. I won't let you hurt these people anymore. Drop your weapon, or be prepared to use it. If, if, if that's the way it has to be? Heck, come on, come on! As if we don't have enough problems. Now we're shooting each other in the back. It's my fault. I knew what was going on, and I didn't do anything. Don't you start. You do good work, and you know it. So what now, Commander? I need to find out why the Geth are after the Thorian. The colonists won't let you near the Thorian. They die first. They're under its control. What else am I supposed to do? There's gotta be another way. I think there is. You could safely use a nerve agent to neutralize the colonists. Like a gas grenade. Sounds good. I'll do what I can. Excellent. Thank you so much, Commander. We'll stay out of your way until you clear a path. <sighs> okay. No, no, no. Won't let me equip it, guys. Ooh, we're gonna run into a little bit of trouble here.
Well, we just ran into a trouble. Let me ask her for some more. Please try to avoid hurting the colonists. <sighs> Use the nerve agent I gave you, if you can. Man. Looks like we're gonna accidentally have to kill him because I was too fooled on junk. I couldn't uh, do nothing. I think I need to start selling some of this stuff and just instead of holding on to it, I'm going to be in order. Hey. What should I say? Maybe I could do it without having to kill him. Maybe I could just run up in there and just avoid, avoid him and get shot. human no hitting the colonists even if the thorian makes them fire on us that's what the gas grenades are for whatever you say commander let's do it i don't got no gas grenades Maybe run past him. Heal up. Take that run past him. They're all over the Borealis. Let's move one of the cargo blocks and see what falls out.
Still in combat. Bruh, I'm not in combat no more. Okay. They're forcing us to have to kill them. Let's get it. Say two, I guess. I tried to fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trusted me. It wants me to stop you, but I won't. I won't! Hello? Yikes. Okay, wait, what am I supposed to do? Something opened. I just don't remember which direction. I think it's that way. It has to be. Something open, so I don't know where it's at. You guys watching if I like, oh, you so dumb. Is that way? I forgot after that cutscene, so I don't even know where it is. To be honest with you, let me see. Oh, is it right here? Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> so slow. So slow. Hopefully Ashley can control it. I don't want to lose her. Or me. I might. My dude might start tripping. Oh yeah, that gave me 28 Renegade and I didn't want I wanted Paragate. Alright, it's cool. Let me see how much I have now though. Dang, I jumped out of a lot. But this is already almost halfway, so I guess. You want to have a mixture of both. Okay, we just have to find this thing and put a couple of rounds into... What the hell is that? That does not look like any plan I've ever seen. This may be problematic. <laughs> yeah, that's not a plant, bruh. That's something else. Uh, look at they move. There's a husk behind y'all. Oh uh, shit, dripping. Blah, blah, blah. Invaders, your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. 
Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them, now! No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Your blood is in the ground, and if you will... That was... that was tough.
Hmm. Turkey, we must keep heading this way. Oh yeah, we were supposed to. Man, I keep getting hit by it, sorry. Thank you for releasing me. Is everything all right? Are you hurt? I am fine, or I will be, in time. My name is Shiala. I serve, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. I came to this world in search of the Thorian. Saren needed its knowledge, and he needed my biotic abilities to communicate with it. Saren offered me in trade, I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Saren's pretty quick to betray his own people. He was quick to betray the Thorian, too. After he had what he wanted, he ordered the Geth to destroy all evidence of his existence. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you're following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. You must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, <laughs> you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. A viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught, it simply exists. 
I need the cipher. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. Are you alright, Shepard? What'd she do? I saw... something. It still didn't make any sense. You have been given a great gift. The experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. You look a little queasy. We should get you back to the ship. I'm sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the Cypher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the Beacon. Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. You tried to do for us. Saved a few. It's more than most would have done. Anyway, thanks. We'll start again. Just not here. Any luck finding my workstation out in the ruins? I managed to find the data and transfer it to your OSD. That's very good news indeed. Thank you. I was there anyway. It was the least I could do. Well, I appreciate it. Here, you've certainly earned this. Thanks again, Commander. Come on, get out of here. Well, thanks again. I hope Exo Jenny learned their lesson. guys that was it for this episode i'll catch you guys again later